Ideally, I was hoping mom would be gone at lunch, she wouldn't see the delivery at all, but right now I got a clear path for Santa's sleigh and the first big gift of Christmas. Hello and good morning everyone. Welcome back. We're so happy that you guys are here with us today. You guys, we won't give you a repeat of yesterday, but we did wake up in a winter wonderland. Brandon is outside, snow blowing, and our snow blower just broke. <laughs> Not awesome. Last night as I was doing the snow blower, I saw this like long green, I don't even know what you'd call it, piece of plastic. It's not in the distance and I must have gotten it in the snow blower. I think it's totally my fault. Maybe I shouldn't have done it. He's out there with a shovel. I feel really, really bad. My fault. He is out there shoveling. He's been out there for a while. I've been inside getting kids ready, woke up early to get kids lunches ready for school today. Tried to do it a couple of times a week. My guy's upstairs gathering everything he needs. He's gonna go to the temple this afternoon with his friends. And then Hazy and Brex. Hazy, are you in the pantry again? Get your matching bows for me. Girls with bows. Where's your matching bows? I have a blue one, so I've got these ones. These ones are perfect. I'll put them in your hair. They're gonna look great. We have got the kid prepped for their teacher gifts. We ended up doing swig gift cards. Tyler had one teacher he wanted to give this to and I said that was fine. I ordered these cute little bags off of Amazon. Kids are gonna help me this afternoon. We're gonna put some treats and a gift card in it for their teachers. You guys, that time is upon us. It is time that we need to be getting teacher gifts, friend gifts, all the things, all the things squared away. We're gonna work on it. Rexy Doodle, you gotta go do this hair. It's yeah. wild and crazy. I cannot believe it's almost time for the kids to be out of school for Christmas break. And I feel like they're starting early this year. They are doing 16th, I believe, until January mm -hmm. 3rd. So you guys have a really, really long break this time. Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Yeah. What are you gonna do all day, every day? Snuggle. couple of things. First of all, we've just been loving playing with this new lighting. This is currently on mood setting, which by the way is a total stunner in the kitchen, but you just hit the mood button. It puts certain lights at 50% brightness so that it just kind of, I don't know, sets the mood. <laughs> we've been having a lot of fun with that. We also learned, sorry, this is a side note. I wasn't going to start with this. We also learned that the ones that are actually on are more illuminated. And I don't know if you'll be able to see that in the video because it's just so subtle, but like right now the dining is on. You can tell because the light around the circle is a little bit more illuminated than like the deck, for example, because the deck lights are not on. Anyways, we're obsessed with this thing. We did this in the main level and then the common area in the basement, which includes the theater. We've said multiple times, if we had to do it again, we would just save up the extra money to do it for the entire house, have it be part of the home budget because it is that much of a game changer. But that's not why I jumped on here. Jumped on here to say that it has been snowing for just about two days straight and I don't think it's stopped and it's sticking. It's gorgeous. It's incredible. We can't get over the views. We can't get enough of this. We've never been fans of the snow. We don't really like the snowy weather. People tease us, then what are you doing in Utah? The greatest snow on earth. And I don't know. We do like Utah. We like where we live. We like uh, being by family, but we've never been huge fans of the snow. This year, for whatever reason, it's got a new feeling. It just feels magical. We're surrounded by it. We used to look at the forecast and it would say snow and you go, well, that's in the mountains. It's not us. I think we're in those mountains because it's been snowing every single day. And it's gorgeous. It looks amazing. I don't know how much mom shared with you this morning. She maybe didn't want to share this, but she wanted to take over the snow blowing duties last night, which I reluctantly relinquished to her. She ran over something, some long, thick plastic tie, some piece of construction that was probably, just wouldn't have seen buried in the snow. No. For whatever reason, it jammed up the blower part of the snow blower. It wouldn't work this morning. It's fresh snow, so I had to hand shovel, which was great because it's very light, fluffy stuff. It wasn't difficult. It was a little bit of a workout. Speaking of workout, mom is at the gym right now hitting the treadmill. You might say to yourself, don't you have a gym in your home? Yes, we do, but we do not have a treadmill. But mom doesn't know, and the reason I'm doing this now before she gets back is that she is having a special Christmas gift delivered today. Santa's sleigh is coming very early. This year, I wanted to get her this treadmill that she's been ooing and aahing about. She absolutely loves. I was waiting for it to go on a sale. I was looking for Black Friday Cyber Monday. Monday. She sent me a link and she's like, oh man, that treadmill I want is on a huge sale. And I was like, oh dang it, too bad, we'll have to wait till next year. And I immediately ordered it right then. That was Black Friday. So it's now middle of December. It's just now being delivered. Good and the bad things that I have a white glove delivery scheduled so that they will put it in the room of choice and assemble it because I don't want to be the one trying to put that together. And I don't want to try and take that down into the basement and destroy all of our brand new walls. That is happening today. The bad news is twofold. One, it just told you it's been snowing for two days straight. So it is a winter wonderland everywhere you look. So I don't know exactly the easiest way to get it downstairs without tracking snow everywhere. Second part is I thought we would have our cement stairs poured by now on the side of the house. The retaining wall hasn't been finished, so it's now been delayed till next week. Plus, I don't think they could have done it in this much snow anyway. So there's no easy access to get a treadmill downstairs from the front yard. Just don't have any great backyard access. So it'll have to go through the house, I'm imagining. Lastly, it's just impossible to hide. I can't keep it a secret. I can't wrap it up. She's going to see it 10 days before Christmas, almost two full weeks in advance. This is her main gift. I don't have much more other than hugs, loves, and a beautiful home to give her on Christmas Day. So her main Christmas gift coming today, any moment now. In fact, they gave me a two hour window for it to arrive. That window is starting in about 30 minutes. <laughs> Of 
the snow is on a level of ridiculous. It's still snowing. It hasn't stopped. You saw earlier, I don't even know if I showed you. I don't think I showed you, but I shuffled the walk this morning when the kids went to school. It's only two hours later. This is what they look like now. I'm trying to get the snowblower out to clear a path because you guys, I just got the phone call. I just got the confirmation that Santa's sleigh is arriving in 15 minutes. I grabbed the camera, told Mindy I was going to video me doing some of the snow blowing for the second time today. Really, I'm trying to capture the moment they arrive and figure out a way to help them get into the home without making a huge mess. Ideally, I was hoping mom would be gone at lunch. She wouldn't see the delivery at all. It'd all be set up. I don't think that's going to happen because they're coming on the front end of their window, which is usually what you'd be grateful for. You would be so glad. But I was kind of hoping they'd come on the tail end of the window because she does have a lunch appointment that she's going to. She would have been gone while everything was getting set up. But I can't pick and choose these kinds of things. It's going to work out just fine. But right now, I got a clear path for Santa's sleigh and the first big gift of Christmas. <laughs> I'm gonna go move the truck. You're supposed to be at lunch, but you're not. I'm gonna move the snowblower as well. Stand by. You might wanna go keep doing stuff, but we're gonna need to go through there into the gym. Love you, we'll be right back. To the gym. All right, Mindy, so I'm actually not videoing myself snow blowing for the second time today. Which, by the way, it works. <laughs> it does, yeah, actually, I didn't yeah. break it. I, I got a couple of things done. I literally don't know what's happening. <laughs> So Santa came a little early, but Santa's little helper wanted to jump on a really great sale that he was told about on Black Friday. So the second he received notification of that sale, he jumped on and made sure his elves were building a brand new Nordic Track treadmill that is being delivered right there. <laughs> Don't cry, you're gonna make me cry. It's just a treadmill. I love you. Mindy's in the gym, she had to drive to in a snowstorm. It oh my was gosh. Scary, and it didn't have to laugh because you had to go all the way there just to get on a treadmill. When we have a gym here at home, but she's not been able to use it because we have no treadmill. I mean, I can run in place, but I can't run like miles. In <laughs> well, place. plus it's very snowy. Anyways, we always knew when we had the home gym, one of the things but that I we wanted was a treadmill. I said, we do not need this right now. Many I times she wait. said that. You didn't know this, but I was watching the site like a hawk. I'm like, as soon as it dips on sale, I'm gonna snag it. Literally right then and there, bought it, scheduled delivery. That. And it came a little early. So do you want to tell you this is your biggest Christmas gift? You're getting it early. This should I'm sorry. be my only Christmas gift. I better not have anything else. <laughs> You're just on Christmas getting it a little morning. bit early, so I'm sorry. But they are right now taking things out of the box. They're bringing it down here. They're going to assemble it here in the gym, and that's I another mean, reason. Before, I was just doing this. <laughs> you should have seen it, guys. She's just in here. Hey, you know what? That works. How many miles? Get you got your there? knees higher. <laughs> but the one that I like may have hinted at that I've wanted in previous months. The kids have been doing recon for too. They're like, Dad, you better get that because she keeps looking it up when she's on her phone. I, I look at it all at the time. It. I really do, and I'm like, one gym. But if it's the one you told me. 2450? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The big old screen has this eye fit thing that like runs you through like So it does workouts like workouts with you. And I was just thinking literally today, I really want to work out tomorrow, but I'm going to the temple after I take the kids to school. So I don't really have time. It'd be cool to go like before the kids wake up. But I was like, roads are going to be so bad. You can you literally have to walk come down, down here. You have to roll out of bed. Walk Do you down know what that means now? I have no excuses. <laughs> that day that I had Jake move this with me. Jake knows that this is coming today, by the way. Jake. <laughs> the project manager for our home building. He helped me physically move this. I was like, dude, I've got to get it centered up and out of the way. It was kind of at an angle. We just had stuff in this area because I need to figure out exactly where to they put the treadmill. I can't believe you did this. Mm, I love you. I love I doing love stuff you. like this. I love you. Oh my you. gosh. <laughs> so cool. Kids so Merry know Christmas. This is happening today? Uh, only Ryler does. Ryler knew about it, but the other kids don't. So they'll be very excited to come to you. Ryler said to take a picture and send it to him when it got put in. I am so excited. I am so excited just to complete the gym. You know what? I kind of always wreck these surprises. Remember the last time you had the I thought for tall? sure you could have seen it on the credit card because this is right on their Nordic track. And I was like, well, can't hide that. I actually did see a charge. There's so much house stuff going on, I was like, oh, it's probably something else. Like, I literally didn't think anything else of it. I'm actually very surprised that I got a surprise in because your reaction was like, okay, she definitely didn't know. She definitely didn't know. Oh, I'm so excited. Looks like for I'm you gonna to go it. for a run later today. Heck yeah. Two fun things about this house that were decisions that we had to make or kind of were on the fence on that are coming into play in the clutch right now. One, they're using the basement stairs into the merch room to access this area because we don't have the cement stairs poured on the side of our house yet. When I ordered this, I thought, oh, for sure, we'll have the cement stairs on the side. We'll walk right down the side of the house in these doors and straight into the gym, no problem. Fortunately, because of some setbacks and the weather, we have not poured the cement steps on the side of the house. So there is no way to get to the back of our house now, especially in this snow. So they're using the basement merch stairs, perfect solution. They walk it straight down, straight through the basement and in. The other thing that we had had to make a decision on is the single door versus double door. One of the reasons we were encouraged to do the double door into the gym is in case you wanted to move any equipment in or out. Well, the plan was that we would have all the equipment installed before we moved in. So I thought, well, I don't really need double doors. Everything that's going to be in there is going to stay in there. Already coming in clutch, the double doors as they walk the treadmill straight through. No problem. Wide open spaces.
When I originally ordered this, it was asking me for all of this information that is tied to the machine, your workout program, but I didn't want to put in any of Mindy's phone numbers, email addresses, because she would have gotten the heads up that I it was know. coming. So we have a lot of setup to do, but guys, we wanted to reveal to you, show to you, unveil the finished treadmill. I think that that is the perfect spot. Kind of awesome. I think it's amazing, and it really completes the gym. Like now, you open the doors, you don't go, oh, what is this, like a aerobics room? You're like, oh, it's a gym. Clearly, there's a treadmill, there's a weight set. My phone can go right there, water bottle right there, sweat rag right there. This is very basic, I was just saying, but I think everything's kind of controlled up here. here. Yeah. yeah. So right now, she's taking a picture of this, registering the machine to her <laughs> phone. She can put an email and sign up for this iFit. You do get a free like something 30 days or something to yeah. try it out and see if you love it and I think you 30 days it. and you're gonna probably need the internet when you use this we just got some late breaking fantastic amazing news you guys we will have it's been all but guaranteed to me internet tomorrow that's pretty fantastic news they have got the supervisor of the supervisor of the supervisor came out today he's sending a supervisor to come hook up internet for us tomorrow tomorrow morning ish they're gonna come and set up the internet and there's actually gonna be a few things going on at the same time candy counter in the concession area got delayed to tomorrow I'm supposed to get the remote to turn on this fan. You can actually turn on the fan and not sweat like crazy because in a gym, you don't want it to be super hot. You're gonna heat it up yourself here on the treadmill. Mindy, look at you on your brand new treadmill. This is incredible. I'm so excited, what's that? The best part of the whole so process. Satisfying. I literally can't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> it's so cool. That's about as fast as I run. You think I'm a fast runner? Working hard or hardly working? I'm actually really slow. I'm right here by the theater candy. I can just have like a little <laughs> thing of candy right here. That's your motivation, Mindy. Pop in my raisinettes <laughs> as I run. And I'm over here taking a nap on the nap bench. Perfect, really. Just adding in some stats here. Okay, then your weight, Mindy. How much do you weigh? Do they have horizontal running? I'm doing horizontal running. We have debated, by the way, guys, let's throw this out there for the masses, having the treadmill face this wall, literally centered here and comes out this way. It's not crazy long. Move this over there. I think it looks cool, too, as you come into the gym, and you've got the treadmill right there. Doing a test one here, because it's in Punta Sur to walk. Start a workout okay. to see what happens. I'm in slippers. I don't know what it does. Like, is it a video? <gasps> walking, we're walking, people. We're walking. I'm walking here. If you do the New York one, does somebody cut you off in the intersection? They say, I'm walking here. Two minutes and 30 seconds till it starts. So, oh, you can hit end warm up. <gasps> is that your music or is that coming from the workout? This. Wow. Okay, now here, check this out. You can do booth with accessories, so you could connect your phone oh, or your AirPods. Do end warm Let's just do this thing. Let's hit it, boys. As you go on the walk that he's going on, this treadmill mimics the conditions. Hold on a second, I'm gonna open this window and see if it's sunny Mexico outside. One second. Nope, still snowing, still in Utah. Still Utah. There's a fan built into that. Oh my gosh, it's air conditioning built in. Wow. That's so much better than the gym. <laughs> it's your oh own gym, Mindy. Now there's no incline. This is just a nice breezy walk. This is freaking awesome. This is pretty cool. I can't wait to just play with it a little bit more. I can just do this and watch my shows. Tonight, I'm not sure if we're still doing it. But Mindy was like, hey, just a heads up. The kids are going to do the fun thing where they shop for gifts for each other with my parents at the dollar store. So we're going to want to make sure we've got some kind of a vlog lined up before they take off. And I was like, oh, don't worry. I got oh, yeah, you. We're going to yeah. be breaking out the yeah. treadmill and playing with it. Real Sneaky. <laughs> it's been so much fun surprising her. I don't get many surprises in. This one was a good one. This one was really good. So I think we get the kids' reaction when they get home. They're gonna be pumped. Rag I knew about it. He's pretty excited. When they take off, let's maybe get a little yeah. workout in, yeah. should we? I wanna try it out. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys think? <laughs> Mom's made Christmas gift came a little bit early. <laughs> you guys like it? Believe this. Look how cool that is. What? 
was trying so hard not to say it when I picked him up from school. I was like, yeah, it's been a pretty eventful day. We're getting internet tomorrow. Uh, what else can I talk about? <laughs> We're gonna do it. Mom can do workouts, <laughs> log into it and everything. It's literally touch screen. The whole thing's a big old touch screen. Crew, what do you think of this, Guys, bro? So, so you can do runs in Mexico. <laughs> I did one in uh, Islam Island of the Island of the Ladies. It's actually just a walk. Crew's been there. Anyway. Right. <laughs> Crew runs that place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's in it Hawaii. Like Hawaii. Yeah, so if you want to run in Hawaii, you can do that. And here's what's sick, dude. So mom's doing it, right? The guy starts going up a hill, the treadmill starts raising. It starts going up because so you're she's going up a hill. Up a hill. It starts going a little bit faster, speed picks up. You basically are running with somebody. What if they're too fast? You're like, <laughs> I can't keep up. Ryan, slow down. Other <laughs> thing that's cool is it's not just <laughs> for runs. Mom can do workouts that involve dumbbells yeah. and just turn the screen towards her this way. Do this and be like, oh, and then sorry. there's a trainer on the screen. Today, because I already lifted my 15. <laughs> oh my gosh. The trainer on there giving her instructions and she just stands here and does the workout. Anyways, I've been trying That's to keep that so a the whole drive home. Yeah. I know you guys think it's very cool. They just so complete exciting. the gym, bro. Now we got dumbbells, treadmill, full weight set. Now it's a gym, baby. Kids just got picked up by Mana and Papa. They're off doing their secret Santa shopping at the dollar store. One of their favorite traditions that they look forward to every year. Mana and Papa have them for the night. That leaves just me and Mindy here and we have been dying to try out this new treadmill. So I think for the first time, we're gonna get a workout together in our home gym. What a fun time getting a workout in with mom. She's getting ready for bed. We're gonna turn on a holiday movie and we're gonna just chill by the fire as we wait for the kids to come home. And then when they get home, they're gonna wrap the gifts that they've got tonight. We wanna hear all about the experience. We know this is one of their favorite traditions. Excited to hear about how their night was. How was your night tonight getting all those fun so presents? Much fun. That was so, so much, much fun. <laughs> Guys, this is a tradition girl. they've been doing since I can remember where my parents take them to Dollar Tree. They pick out a gift for everyone in the family and themselves. Oh, you guys got one for yourself too. Ooh. And our first gifts under the tree back there. No, it's not crew. Although, you'd make somebody's Christmas wish come true. <laughs> <laughs> Santa came and brought me the most amazing, beautiful, awesome present. That was so today. fun. A little workout tonight while the kids were gone. I still cannot believe it. Got the greatest workout in. Your reaction was, I was the most priceless thing. I was sweating like crazy. We do have another Christmas gift coming tomorrow, but we're gonna make you wait and find out what it is. But it's one that we've been waiting for for quite some time. It's gonna revolutionize this home and the way we live in it. Oh yeah, so excited. You guys, we love you so much. Thanks for hanging out with us, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Night, everybody. Bye. A brand new Nordic Dutch treadmill that is being delivered right here. Don't cry, you're gonna make me cry. Just the treadmill. <laughs> Look at you and your brand new treadmill. I literally can't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> it's so cool.